Hello, players. I'm here on my Nintendo Switch, playing with my Joy-Cons, and we are going to drop into Cat Quest. Long ago, dragons ravaged the lands. Only cats, known as the Dragon Blood, could defeat them. But suddenly, they vanished, never to be seen again. The end. Well, okay then. That's rather abrupt, huh? <clears throat> Turn the music down a bit, because I'll make sure you can hear me. And let's drop into a new game. Will you always be there for me? Always. Man, talk about needy. Yeah, sister. They're cute. <laughs> I like them. Made by the Gentle Bros. Wow, really? I see a dragon. Another dragon, more dragons. Lots of dragons. Oh, you can't see. Let me move this. <clears throat> Opening credits in the game, huh? Interesting. That's bald. No, sister. I'll never let go, Rose. I'll never let go, Jack. Here, let me pry your frozen fingers off this door so you can sink to the abyss, never to be seen again. I like the paw loading screen. Cute. All right, here we are. <clears throat> oh, goodness, you're alive. I'm Spiri, your guardian spirit. Oh, Spiri? Really? Listen, dragons have returned. We need to scurry to a town quickly. We can save your questions for later. Just trying to figure out what this little cat sounds like. Use the left stick to run. That's interesting. I was going to try the right stick. That's typically what you use to run in a video game. A coin. A blue thing. We have experience points. Woo! Woo! What should we do? Catnip Cove. Love it. All right, the arrow wants us to go there to follow the red line. So let's do that. A monster is coming up. <clears throat> Press the Y button to attack. All right, let's do it. Oh, like we're literally gonna attack it right now. A red circle shows an enemy's attack range. Press B button to roll away. Oh, cute. It's a little backpack. It's being covered by my face. I don't know what to, where to put myself. I'm gonna go smaller. All right, so here's another guy. So we're attacking him right on the map. Rolling out of the way. You can catnip in towns to heal your wounds. Try it. Oh, catnap. Sorry, not catnip. My bad. I was going to be like, oh, English error there. So let's catnap. We have catnapped. I thought this was like the overworld, and we were going to have to enter. <clears throat> you know, like different worlds from this map and not actually do anything on this map. But uh, so far we're doing stuff on map. Careful of the forest. You can't see what's lurking inside. That's okay. It's probably Pokemon in there. I'm not sure why I can't move while I'm in that backed up view. The mage notices the mark on your head. Meow, that mark of the dragon's blood. You mean the fabled dragon slayers? The laser disc game from the 80s? They vanished many years ago. But, but this is good. That mark means you are. You can learn magic. Come this way. Let's go learn magic. Let's do it. I want to learn magic.
Right, fortunately I can learn Dragon's Purr now. Press the L button to cast it. Can I practice? Oh! Again, that was awesome. Alright, so we got Dragon's Purr. Let's test your magic on that monster. Where? Nice. Ooh. Level 2. I wish the video feature worked, like, system-wide. I mean, what a bummer I can't do video clips. The, the bat cave. This is, this is level 8 and I'm level 1, so I'm not sure if we should have even gone in here yet. Um, I'm dead. It didn't even say you died, it just said game over. Yeah, let's go hack up some bad guys. Let's check this out. No quests available. Why not? Little arrows tell me where it wants me to go, but I want to level up a touch. So I'm pressing the left uh, shoulder button to do this fire attack, and then just hacking and slashing with X to uh, kill the bad guys. Cave, uh, grotto, level one. Let's go in there. I mean, it's telling us to go somewhere else, but I don't know, we'll do it. We'll go somewhere else. The cat patrol. The cat patrol. Oh my lord! All right. So by attacking him, we regain mana. So now I've used all my purple. Attacking him gets my mana back. Is he dead? He's dead. I've killed the dragon. And freed the cat, so the game's over! Roll credits! Hmm, interesting. Okay. The cat patrol. I guess this is just like the tutorial kind of right now. Been setting up a little bit of the, the basic storyline. The mark of the dragon blood on the back of my head. Alright. King Leonardo has come to see us. The kindest and most valiant king of them all. Of them all? Ah. Man, he lays down the law, huh? Alright, he was mad. He threw everyone away. We're level 3. We've completed our first quest. Ah, oh, I wanted him facing with the 3. A white cat kidnapped my sister, and I end up being a dragon blood. No way that's a coincidence. No furry way. Wow, he just used the F word. And masked it as the word furry. That's interesting. <laughs> well, the catnap's how we save. Alright, so let's go over here and catnap. Alright, he gets everything back, and now the game is saved. Even though it didn't actually tell me it saved. There's a quest here. Accept quest. This will put the main quest on hold. No. Let's do the main quest first and then come back and check out the side quest. Alright, this one's a level 1. Compared to the level 8 that I just died like abruptly and earlier. And there's nothing here. Well, I mean, if you've got full mana, use it because as soon as you start hacking and slashing, you get it back. Another chest. Magic staff. Mage staff. Level 1. Equip new items in your backpack. So, on the bottom left, you'll see there's a little backpack with a plus sign. And that's where we can see what we have. So, I just equipped that. That's already been equipped, obviously. 
So now I've got a new weapon, the uh, Mage Staff. Put myself away for a second. I think I accidentally turned off my magic. Well, I can set where I want it to go, look. So now it's left trigger. Nice, that's sweet. You can see on top right it says I'm level one. Everywhere I put my face in this game, I'm blocking something of significance. But you want to see my face because I'm awesome. Alright, we're going to get the paw out of here because there's, our sister is clearly not here. Obviously, in the very first dungeon of the entire game. I got a hat! Or a vest. Or something. I want to wear it. It's a, a mage vest. So I equipped that. Now I'm wearing the mage vest. I guess my defense has gone up. Or something along those lines. How do I get out of here? Can I just climb up out of this hole? Yes. Where? Where's the white cat? I don't see it. Oh, there he is! It's him! Is he giving me the finger? No, it's a spike on his shoulder. No, you won't. What? You're gonna fight him? Is this like a circle of doom? We have to stay in here in the circle of doom? Oh, I would beat him, but it was a clone. Dragoth. <laughs> Sorry. I was going to follow him. To... Why would I do that? I want to do a side quest. Oh, we can't right now. I have ensured the puny peasants can't see me. They are not worthy. <laughs> See the great king of cats hiding in his palace. Reduced to a quivering mess because of my powers. I have no idea what that means, but okay. Really? Did he just carefully tell me I should check the quest board? He did, didn't he? I will be happy to... Are we supposed to keep following him? He's like... Come on! did, but <laughs> all right. Oh. Let's go back here to Kit Kats. That's funny. Master Kit Kat. It has. Oh, sorry. Master Kit Kat. It's been a long time. Spirit, I told you, just call me the Kit. You folks looking for weapons and armor? Are you matey? So this is the shop. We're going to buy stuff at the blacksmith. I'm really surprised they didn't call it the catsmith. Alright, so let's go. This reminds me of... Um, swords and Soldiers. Wait, it's pure luck? I have to... No. Oh boy. All right. Yeah, let's do it. All right, get an, uh, an axe, a level two weapon. I don't know why it doesn't offer me to equip it now. <clears throat> so there you go, I've equipped it. 
curious if I roll again, if I can get a different weapon, or if I shouldn't roll again. I mean, I doubt it's an axe every time, right? <clears throat> Alright, so now we're gonna go look for dragons. <clears throat> I don't know if I should sometimes deviate from what it's telling me to do in this, like, tutorial phase of the game, because, look. A blue guy right there. And I can hack these guys up. Oh. Oh, I see. I need to pay a touch more attention. Just a touch more attention, because I just, um, died. And it didn't save what I did in here. So let's grab that axe real quick. What if I don't get the axe this time? This is being interesting. I kind of want the axe. It's a nice level 2 weapon. Level 3 ninja robe? Minus 5 defense, plus 5 and attack, I guess. Oh lord. Let's do it again. Oh, I'm too short. So I've lost my new weapon. That's amazing. Um, by amazing, I mean that sucks. That was a level 1, and now this is a level 3. So I'm wearing that. <clears throat> Let's go follow him. Alright, so he's found a dragon. And he's marked it on the map. He told me to press the minus button, I think, but I don't see it. It's down that way. This is big. Oh my god, we're gonna play all this? This is a big map. Oh, nice. <clears throat> oh, I need 50 coins to roll that dice again, huh? And I guess he's got some kind of side quest there for me also. Before we, uh... Before we go to the dragon, let's, um, catnap first. Game saved. And let's... <clears throat> See if we can't buy a better weapon from Kit Kats. Bring me clothes. Give me a weapon. Oh, no. Oh, plus heart, minus attack. I don't want that. So we just wasted 50 coins. I'm guessing 50 coins isn't much. You know, as we play, it'll become, I guess, very little. But yeah, if you get a weapon you want, you want to take that catnap because... <clears throat> I lost my nice weapon. I mean, am I really supposed to just follow that arrow? Where's the dragon? Ooh, ooh. Can learn a new magic for 50. Oh, I just wasted it. Oh no. Oh. How do you get to him? I wonder if I'm supposed to run right to him or if I'm supposed to, you know, play different things. I'm gonna just run to him and see. Monument. This is the catnap. We can catnap here. Good to go. Twin Peaks, look. Nice. Oh. I played it more carefully. It's okay, I just saved. So we're gonna wake up, I think, right where I just saved, right, right there. Let's see if we can't fight him more carefully. Yeah, I killed him all I could take a hit. So we're just gonna be a little more careful. <clears throat> Let's try these guys. Dead. Okay, 
okay, now time I die. So, um, we're not quite ready to take on all these guys. We want to, like, wait a little bit, I suppose. This is, like, Breath of the Wild, like Zelda. You know, you want to... Oh, they... Oh, my God, my stuff stayed! Really cool. Really cool of the game. Not to wipe out what I had actually unlocked. Let me go pick it up. Let's go to that dragon <clears throat> and avoid these guys. That's, like, their attack range right there, the circle. Uh... How am I going to beat this dragon, though? I can't even beat the little guys. Alright, so see, now it's still kind of teaching us. It made me come all the way here to teach me, though. It's saying, don't bother with this dragon. And level up first, come back later. Even though you can fight it now. <clears throat> hey, again, Zelda Breath of the Wild-ish. You know, just because you can get there, uh, doesn't mean you should. Oh, boy. And dead. Game over. Alright, so now that we've basically got the, the basics of how to play, this is when we really start playing, I think. We start uh, taking on some side quests, looking for caves that we can actually handle, and bad guys that we can actually handle. Let's see, those were level 15. Um, here's the monument. Here's a shop to buy more stuff, but we need 50 coins. I don't have it. Kid catnap here. And that's a level 10 quest. No, let's go back to where we started. Um, and accept an easy quest. It's trying to take me to the dragon still because we didn't do that. Let's do this. <clears throat> Alright, so we have a side quest now and that's going to put our main quest on hold. The main quest was just to uh, literally go look at the dragon. And then it will tell us that we shouldn't fight it yet. We should power up. Because I died, that was never saved. So it doesn't know we've actually done that yet. So we'll have to do that next. Oh, look. He's using the axe that I thought I had lost. Look, I do have the axe. It stayed. It kept the axe when I died. So when I went back, I got something else. Good to know. Oh no, the shipment never showed up. So let's catnap real quick. And let's follow the shipment. Because I've saved, I can feel a little brave enough to take these guys on. Level 5, and I get all my life back because it's level 5. Nice. I think after this quest, we will stop playing. Oh, it's in there. Right, let's go. Weak to magic or physical, huh? Take note of the color. Okay, so purple is weak to magic, and yellow is weak to physical. Oh, look, they're fists. I don't really see the color. By now, I should have a second um, magic attack, but I screwed up and wasted all my money. So I need to get a lot more money. The magic attack actually burns them for a while. If you hit them, you'll watch and see they continue to take damage. So we just missed killing one. Let it do its thing. We're gonna die. This isn't good. What's in here? Oh. Level 2 plus life plus defense. Do I want to wear that? That's level 3. Will reduce my weapon a lot. Like, give me some extra life. I need that, I think. I'm not really sure, to be honest with you. 
<clears throat> Let's try to avoid some of these guys. Oh, shit. Shoot, shoot, I said shoot. I need a key. Um, down the stairs. Um, I couldn't figure out what to do there. Hmm. No! Really? But you keep everything. That's really cool. Alright, so we're, we're resuming from our last save point, but keeping everything we've earned. So in other words, I kind of get a stronger attempt at it this time. Even though the story uh, resets itself, doesn't remember I did this. That's interesting. The chest is gone. So I need a key, and I think I'm going to get that key by attacking these bad guys. <laughs> Dead. Oof, this is tough. Let's see what I... 18... Trying to see if it keeps my money also. I want to buy a new um, magical ability because I probably should have had one already. A second one. But what happens, I can fight these other little bad guys and wander around a bit. And power up before I even take on this quest. If it turns out this is too hard for me. Which, um, if I die again, I'm going to go ahead and assume it is. So let's try to get past these guys. He's got a big range. He just attacked. Attack and get out of his range. Attack and get out of his range. Alright, they're all dead. Except those guys, huh? But I need a key. I guess I'm going to get that key from them. Oh, they don't move, so... Hit them and run. 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 All right, one more to go. You actually see them attack. That red, see? Got him. Alright, it said something about um, the carriage must have been destroyed and we should go report back. Uh, no key was dropped. Mm, that's lame. Not, not really happy with that. Is it gonna. Yeah, it is gonna help me. Alright. But I'm gonna die if I have to get take another hit. I don't want to fight that again. That's stupid. Let's report back. The shipment in his swims with the fishes. So we get a reward anyway. Uh, level three defense. Uh, level six. Having completed another quest. And I have a level 3 defense. So we have a lot of options here to choose from. Knight's armor gives me 4 defense. So this arrow here is taking us to main quests. Although we're not bound by that. We can uh, wander about. Take on side quests. Fight bad guys and power up first. And I guess when we're ready. Take on the, uh, the dragon over there. I'm really starting to go to whip a little bit of tail here. I can't see the stuff I dropped on the floor, though. I'm guessing I should take a cat nap. Got him. I know where they're taking us. Cat nap. You know where they're taking us? The dragon. Because I never actually went to it to have it tell me that I shouldn't go to it yet. So let's do that and then we're going to wrap this video up. Unfortunately, it's way around the corner. 
There's a side quest right there. I can catnap just to save. Look how quick it is. Is that a run button? No, but it's wrong. Let's see if we can beat these guys up. They killed me before. No, they killed me again. So you do want to attack, hit and run, get out of their, their zone. You don't just want to randomly slash at them until you're really strong enough. Clearly the case right there. But this main quest isn't going to help us until this arrow, until we see that again. See, it's going to tell me, no, wait until you're stronger. Now we can go do our side quests as we wish. There's all these boards that offer them. There were quite a few side quest boards I'm seeing. So very cool. There's one right there. Looks like there's a lot of options in how you can go about playing this game. It's not just linear. There's no quests on this one. So that's the cat quest. That's the first uh, 30 minutes, 31 to be exact. Um, geez, I like it a lot. It plays really well. Pretty impressed. I'll be back for more um, for sure. So stay tuned. I'll catch you next time. Please subscribe. Please share. Please tweet. Please hit the like button. Thanks much and game on.